Ryan, and joining us now live this morning to tell us more about the upcoming Fort Rucker Wiregrass Job Fair is Stephen Schmidt, and he's the PR director from Enterprise State Community College. And thanks so much for joining us. Oh, happy to be here. Yeah, drove all the way from Troy. I did. So I did. thanks for waking <laughs> up early. We appreciate it. So let's talk about first the job fair is actually going to be on July 31st. Mm -hmm. So we've got a little bit of time, but there's actually a free job fair readiness training uh, prior to the job fair. So tell us about what that is. Well, it's just to uh, prep, you know, anybody that's not ready to, um, you know, go for an interview. Uh, it'll help with resumes, um, with attire. Um, okay. Just get, you know, anybody that may be nervous about going to, you know, an interview, um, just get them ready. Just to get them know. better prepared. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's going to be offered at Enterprise State Community College there in Enterprise, right. but then also at the Troy Dothan campus as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, so do people need to register in advance for that? Or? Yes, uh, they can go to southeastalabamaworks.com okay. and, um, and actually, you know, register for the event itself, but also um, you'll find those dates and times uh, for the job readiness available on, on that website. Okay, and let's talk about specifically how many employers in the area will be represented and how many jobs are well right now it's over a hundred employ uh, employers mm -hmm. that are, that's going to okay. be at this event and okay. um, there's going to be over six thousand jobs available wow yes and so um, anything uh, and everything from it, give us anything. some examples of some of the jobs yeah just some retail you know um, all the way from retail um, to uh, aviation I mean, it, Just there, there's anything a, and everything. Yes, yeah, huh? so large rate. No matter what level you're at, what stage you're at, there will be a job available there for you. Okay. So people, applicants, when they're coming, do they need to bring anything other than an updated resume, or you you would need to bring multiple resumes, and you would dress to hand out, obviously. Right. Yeah. Yes. Uh, dressed to impress, of course. Uh, it would be like a standard interview. Okay. Um, you know, standard job interview. So you would come in, and actually there would be spots for you to step off to the side. And be interviewed by these employers. Mm -hmm. Any like being hired hired on the spot? Or? Yes. Oh, okay. yeah. Absolutely. Right. Matter of fact, I think last year uh, over a hundred people got employed. Wow! As so, a result of the job fair. Uh, right. And how many years have y'all been ha hosting this, this job fair? This is the fair? 16th annual uh, okay. job fair, and and Enterprise State Community College is just thrilled to to host uh, this this great event. Yeah. And so just to recap, July 31st, mm -hmm. where specifically at Enterprise State Community College will it be held? Well, it'll be in two spots. It'll be in actually in our community room in the student center, as well as in our gymnasium, uh, okay. Lolly Gymnasium. So actually, if they come and park in parking lot C, uh, uh, you'll come right in and uh, to the student center. Okay. And what specific time is it? All day event? No, it's only from nine to one. Okay. Uh, so uh, you know, be early, uh, be ready to uh, you know just basically shop around and see what's uh, available for you. It's open to anyone and everyone, as we've said. Anything else you want to mention? about uh, the job fair? Well, no. I mean, uh, I mean, at this moment, uh, really what we want is uh, the wiregrass to be employed. So mm -hmm. ultimately, yeah. uh, you know, uh, this is the opportunity for you to come and, and, and do that. Absolutely. Well, it sounds like uh, I would imagine y'all always have a great attendance, and hopefully y'all yes. will. And thanks so much for joining us uh, this morning. And, of course, we can't cover all of the details due to time restraints, but as always, we're going to put full details about the dates and the times and how you can register on our website at dothanfirst.com. And still coming up on Wake Up Wiregrass, you will want to stick around for this because we have a very heartwarming story of a World War II vet and his lover who finally were reunited after 70 years.